Carmine Costello is in court today seeking to expunge his criminal record in hopes of applying to the PD. This guy? A cop? After what he did in Dogtown? <laughs> Excuse me. This is the People's Court. Why, why do you grace this? Hello. I'm here to speak against you. You ain't gotta do all this, little bro. You ain't go, you ain't gonna hold me back. You you understand me? I'm gonna get what I want this way or the other way. Hello. You're not gonna like the other way. How you doing? What you even gonna say? You ain't got no dirt on me. Just go ahead. Go up there, pal. I'm not, I'm not worried about you, bro. I'm not worried Break a leg. about you. Andy, take care of him. Andy, take care Listen, of him. Listen, no, how you've been treating me, I don't know what I'm gonna say. Are you now, serious, Andy? Am I you treat me made? like the right thing, Andy. And, Andy I gotta tell the, the truth. Thing. Anyone who would like to speak for or against Mr. Costello, please step forward. Uh, Your Honor, people Here, of the court. Can I, can I say something? Uh, please? I was going to give you no the opportunity to say something at the end of this. This man likes to derail people. He's a thief. He's a thief what of pants. Fuck? Okay. He likes seeing people in a tight whites. I want you to remember that every after. Uh, yeah, what he's about we're to here say. to speak facts, not accusations. I am here to testify against Karma Casol because I don't believe he's yet to learn his lesson. <laughs> As a man who was crowned the warden or the co-warden of the penitentiary. That was supposed to look after the people that have committed heinous acts such as terrorism and murder. To allow them to escape, to walk up to the gates and to just open up and say, hey, walk out. It's okay. You can just run away. He had one job, your honor. Don't let them leave. Instead, they were able to escape and they led into a, a police shootout and there was a lot of bloodshed before they were apprehended. So, I don't believe in the meantime, Carmine Casella has gotten better as far as his actions. And uh, therefore, that's why I'm testifying against him. Is Carmine incompetent, uh, completely stupid? Yes. He is a man of many words with very little substance. But does he break the law? Hey. No, he may Save skirt me. the line and invent things to fit, but he does not go against the law in ill faith. I've seen him do some good things, but I he's not a good person, but he deserves a second chance. Can you really blame someone for the ineptitude of their mental capacities? No. He's the way he is. He's a product of his own creation. I don't think he means to do bad. He just it's kind of forced upon him just with how how dumb and pathetic he is as a as a man. He killed my sister. See, it's oh, murder. Go. What? My God. Lemon yeah, tea was a human sized cockroach. She got what she deserved. What the fuck? Oh, Whoa. No remorse, Yana. No remorse. No guilt. Carmine here has caught a lot of people's attention, a lot of people's eyes, and. A lot of times, it's something negative. He's kind of like the cockroach, really. But I, I think his harsh personality uh, is just a facade. And he actually reveals like a warmer and friendly, friendlier side over time. I, I believe he is a Sundra. Like He shows like he doesn't care what, what he really does. Deep down inside. Damn, she's good at bullshitting, huh? By what he says, even though his actions does match uh, his words too. Actually, not all the time. I don't know. I believe he's a good guy. Deep down. Yeah, I, 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 I don't deep, know what she's talking down, about. He's gonna really like dig into it. I don't know what this soulless ghoul lady's talking about. She doesn't know anything about me. It's a cow. See, it's real. <laughs> <person. He said laughs> Uncover it. <laughs> Look at that, Sandra. You got there and weeb. The first time I met Carmine, he beat the fuck out of me at Legion Square and then proceeded to call me an insignificant little shit and I deserve to die. I don't think this man's a remorseful person. I've told him repeatedly he needs to get his shit together and stop being mean to people. And in turn, he became a sadistic fucking running the DOC. This man deserves to be stuck in prison for the way he is such a mean person. And we should chop off his pinky.
Thank you. Most people that have said bad things about me, it sounds like they got more problems internally than me. And all the people that came up here and said nice things who are actually genuine. I think that's all, folks. You all can go home now, especially you, Peach. Is there anyone else who has anything that they would like to say? You know what? I got a few words to say about my best friend, Carmine Costello. Thank you, Eagle. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Let's see here. Today alone, I have witnessed him organize to come to the courthouse several different gang wars between himself and something yeah. called a chain gang don't know what the fuck mm. that is <laughs> but he per he proceeded to rally himself and the clowns and head down to grove street in the cul-de-sac and started all out brawl in the street come to the courthouse i don't know what the hell you were thinking carmine yeah, it's all on video damien got it on his on his documentary camera there's there's videographic evidence of you not only where the participating where are the tapes you say that where, where are these tapes i, I don't know da damien's not here tapes? but i'm sure i'm sure you can subpoena them or something yeah. anyway like like not all like like you premeditated a whole war carmine i don't know what the fuck you were slander thinking. What the? You can't object to what One, the two, fuck? Three, four, five, Carmine, six, more seven, like eight, warm mine. Yeah, exactly. Ooh. That's a compliment. Exactly. Thank you. But with that being said, he is my best friend, and I have seen him single-handedly corrupted by Bobby Charles, and I'd like to see that uh, stop. So, if we can just like separate the two, I think Carmine will come out on top. All right, I gotta hang up. Anyway, that's all. I would like to say, uh. I, you know, I came in here. Carmine showed me such great loyalty. He's always been such a such a swell man. Tell him about your me. backstory. And so, you know, I got a long backstory. I'm not gonna tell nobody about. But here's the thing. <laughs> He's been such a great, great, beautiful angel man to me. But yeah, yeah, I say keep him with the record. Why? <laughs> I just I just heard a lot of good arguments today. Go back up there. What do you want me to say? All right, so here's the drill. I said the same thing at Bobby's hearing, but basically, I've never seen Carmine do anything other than abuse every ounce of power he's ever had in his entire life to demean, cripple, and upset people below and above him. Uh, in his opinion, or his mind, although everybody's probably below him in his mind. Uh, that being yeah. said, you know, if you guys decide to like do an expungement, yeah, he'll probably fuck it up in a week anyway. So, uh, yeah. Yeah. Look, I, I feel like Carmine has a history of being one of those people that is given unlimited chances and then inevitably messes up. Put him under the jail. <laughs> under the jail. That's okay. <laughs> Well, look, but <laughs> Christ Winslow, that's uh, look, Carmine, you know, he means well, right? Even though he does poorly and does bad and is cruel and unusual towards everybody, especially his friends. And, you know, he just keeps getting all this money and he can't keep getting away with it. I, look, I still think everybody deserves a second chance. And Carmine is a person. And so I, I you, vote Scotty. in favor of the expungement. Case closed. Crazy, Your Honor. Carmine. Bobby would there like is to a go. man named Blorg in the penitentiary oh. that wants to speak to. Hello, can you hear me, Judge? Yeah. Yes. I would like to let you know that Carmine is not only a good man, but he is an absolute horrible person who blew my arm off. Okay, that's that's enough of that. <laughs> that's enough of that. Okay. You thought that was gonna go, huh? uh -uh. No lie. Spoken, honor, no okay, who's next? I come in front of you to speak about how terrible this fucking rodent of a man is and what a menace to society he is. He mm. is violent, he is evil, and he is sneaky. Lies. He's like a little fucking rodent rat. He's a terrible fucking person, and I can't stand him. He is horrible. He is awful. Peach, please that's save all that me, I have please. to say. You, if you no let this expungement go through, you're I'll endangering you every bad bitch in town, including yourself. Thank you. <laughs> Shut up! Answer this. How do you expect to become a police officer with all the crying and diaper changing? You wouldn't even be able to respond to any calls. I'd have you know. I was one of the finest officers before the cataclysm. They he feared the my name. I was the commander. And now he can't even do anything without a caretaker. 
Who's my caretaker? He could barely do his job without Bobby a Charles. caretaker before. Bobby Charles is Correct. not my caretaker. Bobby hey, Charles is my anchor. We just homies. We just homies. And the worst of there it all, we are too skinny. You need to gain some weight to get stronger. I have a fast gain metabolism. Some or you are medical. denied. You could use a few more cannolis. Okay. Does anyone have a single compelling argument for Carmine? Yes, Your Honor. Your Honor, Carmine Castillo. He's a very good man. A great man, in fact. I believe uh, he has a beautiful wife that he uh, that he provides for every day. Uh, you know, half of his paychecks go, go to his beautiful wife. Go his wife left him. Which wife? Name again? Was, was uh, it Franz? Uh, Franz Gall. His beautiful wife, Franz Gall, he, uh, he provides for her every day. Sam Charitable. He's a charitable man. He's uh, one of the best, you know. Me and him actually went on that... Uh, an incursion today where we uh, went to go help the homeless, the less, the less fortunate uh, under the bridge. Bobby, I already spoke with Damien earlier today. He told me about the documentary and what happened. Choose your words carefully. Damn. Well, I'm not under Earth, so I can't perjure, can I? No, but I can definitely affect Carmine's expungement. Your Honor... Me and Carmine have uh, been through a lot together. He's uh, one of my uh, greatest friends, one of my more than a friend, uh, like family to me, Your Honor. And uh, he may seem like a very uh, evil, sadistic, um, crazed man, but uh, once you get to know him, you actually realize that he's a he's a great man. He's a uh, he's an amazing person, and he'll do anything for you. If you do something, uh, well, he'll do anything for you if you guys, uh, if you're his friend. Runner, he's a great man. I believe that he, uh, deserves an expungement. Damn. No, I would just Hello. like to state that, um, Carmine's downfall has been being friends with Bobby Charles. I think that's why he's in the predicament he's in today. Thank I also you want to state that I do believe people deserve second chances. But I knew Carmen as an officer. He was a great officer. Deep, so deep, deep. just cut out Bobby Charles. I think. I'm sorry, um, Bobby. Just take this for now, so I can get my. Yeah, Bobby free. Charles. Yeah, I'm gonna get fucking got cancer. That's okay, all I and, and you see that again, insulting yes, somebody, and then what? You're gonna hit Wait, me with that you. Again? Wait, you know, I'm gonna get you know, I'm gonna get all Bobby. fucking judges disbarred. <laughs> you just fucking insult people all day. You just wanna hand out contempt because you have no power on the outside. That's me. That's why you got kidnapped, because the oh citizens, the civilians, they hate you. I'm the only reason why that you, you got out of there. Why are you doing this now? Bobby, 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 respect. I say we add crimes to his record. Instead of expunging, can we do, like, the opposite way? Because I hate death that. penalty, that'd be I'm pretty cool. Oh, oh, I already spoke for the death penalty. Yeah. Why I recorded him doing like, so many crimes the other table. day. I could show you the recording if you want. That thing would get him locked up for life. That's all I have you to say. You should probably take that to the PD. <laughs> all right, Carmine, oh, let's see what you have to say for yourself. All right. Ladies and gentlemen of this courtroom, Your Honor, Your Honors. <clears throat> There was a lot said in this courtroom. And frankly, I'm tired of motherfuckers in courtrooms telling me in the barbershop that Carmine ain't about this. Carmine ain't about that. Ain't about that? Yeah, yeah. I'm BD. I'm fucking oh, I'm, Lamron and them. I'm Lamron. Yeah, yeah. They say that I don't be putting in no work. Mm -hmm. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> y'all goofies ain't no shit. Yeah. All y'all motherfuckers talking about. I ain't no hitter. You repping? I ain't no this. Mm -hmm. I'm a fake. Shut the fuck up. Y'all don't live with me like that. Y'all know that I got caught with a ratchet? Mm hmm. Shooting at the. Wait. Uh, shooting, shooting at, at the, the police. No, 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 no. Your Honor. Everybody that, is, that has come up here has demonized me for the role I played as the warden. But there is one universal fact that Dogtown brought to the city. 
And that was that crime did not pay. People used to call officers all the time. I was told this. Many judges tell me this. They tell the officers and judges and members of uh, the government that they hate prison. The experiments, the experience there is terrible. That they, they, they feel belittled and, and hurt. Well, frankly, they should feel that way. Prison is supposed to be a deterrent. And I'm being vilified for turning it into a deterrent. And another thing they wish to crucify me upon is, is inmates escaping. So they say, my cruelty is too much. But then when I am generous, and I allow these people to go out into the free world, shackled, mind you, cuffed, mind you, to do labor, intensive labor, outside, you know, pay back that debt to society, I am also the villain? I help them escape? What is this? I can't win in any front. Carmine ain't, Carmine too nice, Carmine too harsh. I'll tell you this. The only felony on my record that I want removed, okay, is that of uh, violating a court-ordered charge. It was between me and Bobby. None of these felonies are heinous. None of these felonies that I've commit that that I stand accused of are, are, are uh, of any 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 harsh variety. I got this felony on a on a technicality, and I just want it off my record. So I may fulfill yeah. my duty to this state and help people fix themselves with an iron fist up, you and a leather glove if necessary. What were you Bobby is my friend. I will not lie to you. I do not intend to part from him. We will go into this into the fray together, and I believe that if I am denied this uh, expungement because of shit slack, Santa Lemon Chi had to say. These people don't know me. They don't know what they're talking about. What? We should ask the people that actually know me. Like those that worked under me. This, not including Winslow, because Winslow just says shit sometimes. But, but Andy, no. Andy, uh, uh, Scotty, all those guys, they speak the truth. I may be an idiot sometimes, but my heart is in the right place. And I wrote you a song, Your Honor. It goes oh, a no. little like this. Oh, God. Uh -huh. This one goes out to the haters in the back. Mm, That's you, Slacks. Number four. <laughs> Fuck you, Slacks. Fuck you, Slacks. Eat a dick, you dirty bitch. Yeah. Peach, I'm glad Fleming's dead. And Crystal, you look like you eat Chris Crystal meth rocks and shit. Yeah. My beef is personal. I love the police force. But fuck Slacks, fuck us Vato, Eagle, fuck you kinda, fuck all you haters. What the hell? You hate me cause you hate me. Hate you try to take away from my shine. Brian shine bright like a diamond. And fuck you Slacks and boom. That's, that's all you're on it. Uh, Incredibly okay. moving. Come on. As, as always. It's Slacks. <clears throat> All right, there is no denying that your criminal record is pretty bitch made. Uh, what did she just say? And honestly, if it weren't for the overwhelming cries of people begging for you not to get a second chance, I would probably give you an expungement without any caveats. As it stands, it seems like you have a behavior issue, so there is going to be a caveat to your expungement. If you cannot keep your record clean for two weeks, you forfeit all future clean expungement fees. You will go straight to the half million dollar fee to get your next expungement. Is that understood? When you say clean, if I get pulled uh. over, does that mean I'm done? No, no felonies. Oh, that's easy. I've been doing that six months. All right. 
was great work, I'm, over here. I'm so happy. For I am you. billing you fifty thousand dollars. Eat shit, right loser, bitch! I'll see you in the meetings, bitch. This is not true. <laughs> I don't condone anything. God help us all. You are a maybe fly within a week. It doesn't matter. Honest and clean <laughs> citizen, Carmine Costello. Please God keep it that way so that I never have to see you in court again.